Sluice Goose, back! That's right, Goose, Magic Mike, all up in this mother. It is time to dig. Gotta get that gold. Woo! Anyways, Goose, he been out on vacation a little while. That and he was working night shift, so he couldn't wake his sorry butt up to come out and dig. We got some special stuff today. We got Gold Hog, Docks, New Piglet, High Banker. Oh, I'm so excited. Goose is all tongue tied. Well, what's special about this Piglet? Is we got the extension on it. And inside of that extension is a bunch of Docks' new mother load mats. So today isn't about running volume. We want to test these mats. We want to see what they can catch. And where we're at, it is known for that micro fine gold. Whoo! Go! Yeah! Uh. Anyways, so what we're going to do, we're going to run it. Oh, by the way, where is it? Where is it hiding? Where is it hiding? Where is it? Uh, there it is, right there. We got the uh, Honda WH15X pump up on this mother. Not going to lie, this thing's a beast. It'll move water. It's overkill for the piglet. The WX15 is probably perfect for it. It's just when you got a $600 pump that somebody's selling on Craigslist for $125 and it's only been used once, the math does itself. But anyways, we're going to get to it. But before we do anything, it's been too long. It's breakfast time. And, uh, oh, you might be asking, Goose, what's on your finger there? Well, it's Goose, one of Goose's uh, beverage entry tools. And uh, sent to him by a guy back east at North Shore Customs. He hand makes these things, machines them up real nice. Bottle openers. And uh, use it right. It's a great bear defense. Uh, not that I ever want to test it, so... Uh, Oh, get on there. Oh, come on. Yeah. Crag it. Oh, you do it. There we go. Breakfast time. Let the nutrients flow through your body. Anyways, check back in a bit. Time to move some dirt. Woo! Quick observational note. We've been running it for about a half an hour, 45 minutes right now. Sun's messing with my uh, lighting. If you're running the piglet, you definitely want the extension. Can't stress it enough. I've already counted five, six, seven, eight pieces of gold that are inside of the extension. I mean, good size, I mean, little flakes. Nothing crazy. But we're seeing gold in the extension. We're running about 10 degrees on the top box, seven degrees on the bottom box. You can't feed this, the piglet, like you feed the raptor. You just can't dump buckets in it. Your feed rate's gotta be a lot slower. One shovel at a time. At a time. <laughs> it catches the gold. These mother load mats, they're doing their job. The heavies go straight in, everything else get moved, gets pushed right out. I mean like pronto fast. Anyways, we'll show you that in a minute. Hey, real quick, something I want to show you about the piglet and how these mats are laid out. Up here in the top box, lots of violent, turbulent action. I mean, not quite rooster tailing right here, but it's just very, lots of movement in the water. Everything kind of is bouncing around. You can see how much exchange rate you got happening right here in this section of the box. So it's gonna catch a lot of the bigger stuff right up here, right in the first box. This is where the extension, right here. 
everything, look at how everything calms down right here. Goes from like, ay, 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 give me go, give me go, give me go. And then it's like smooth and it's all, I want them last little bits. I need just something to pick my teeth with. Everything's gonna be right down in here. So far, what we're seeing is these mother load mats. They clear way fast. It's hanging on. We can see the uh, garnets. It's starting to turn everything a little bit. It's a little tough to show on camera. But we're getting a lot of purple streaks in here. Right in there. Magic Mike keeps speeding. Keep getting that goal. Goose needs to shut the hell up and get to dig. <laughs> Woo! Sluice Goose, back. What we're getting ready to do right now is test the tailings. Got my little uh, pan o tailings. And uh, we're gonna see what kind of losses we're getting, if any at all. So far the mats seem to be doing their job really, really well. We shall see. Check back in just one second. One, two, three, four, right there. That's the biggest piece right there. And then two so small, you can barely see them. So what that tells the goose is most of the hog stuff runs at about 90, 98% capture rate, which is huge. So if I'm only getting these little itty bitty tiny incy beansy little flecks, I mean so small, you can barely see them. That means the machine is set up and it's doing its job. There will always be losses. There's no way around it, 100%. Anybody says, my, my, my stuff catches 100%. They are selling you a bridge in Arizona. There ain't none with oceanfront property. None. Ever. Anywhere. No, it'd be like Oklahoma saying, oh, I got a piece of the Puget Sound right up. No, you don't. No, you don't. So, if I'm, I can't wait to see what's in the box. We're going to run for about another uh, hour, and then we're going to do a cleanup. Check back in a bit. One, two, three, four, 
five. There's gold in the box. All right, something I want to show you real fast on these mother load mats. Look at how clean these things are. Just pure black sand in there. Some little garnets. Look at that. No lots of dirt. None of, oh wait. What's that? Gold! <laughs> but these mats are just down to the absolute. This, this is what you want to see. Just black sand in the bottom of them. Oh, look at that, another piece of gold. Who da? All right, we're gonna, we're gonna yank the mats. Check them out, have a little lunch. See you in a bit. Hey, guess what? It's lunch time. And a lot of you are sitting back going, Goose, it's gonna be summertime and it's hot out. Yes, it is. And you're going, how do you keep that non-disclosed beverage at a nice crisp temperature? Let me show you a little river hack. River stays at a nice crisp 45 degrees. It's cold. What better place to keep your non-disclosed beverage cold than in another liquid? Actually, if you look at it from a mechanical heat exchange point, the fastest way to cool a liquid is with another liquid. <laughs> Hang on one second. Yeah, hands are wet. One for goose. One for Magic Mike. Mm. Mm. Lunch time! Hey everybody! Wrapping it up for the day. The Goose and Magic Mike, we are wiped out. Still gotta clean the box. I ain't even kidding, this sun just sucks the life out of you. So between the two of us, kind of figured out an easy way to clean the box. May not be the preferred method, but probably accomplishes the same thing. Check it out. Hit it. is clean <laughs> I just messed with you we already cleaned it all out we got all the cons we're gonna pack it up the heat has just kicked the crap out of us today so we're gonna have the last one Start packing things out. Check back in a bit. Hey everybody. Done. Had to move back up into the shade. Got all the uh, equipment right there. Now we just gotta hike it out of here. Which sucks. But before we start hiking, gotta upload them nutrients. We know we got gold. That, that, no dispute about that. The question is how much? We weren't shooting for like monster piles of gold. This was more of a test of a, the piglet itself. And the mats that were in it. And I'm not gonna lie, those mats do work. Holy cow. They catch the gold and the amount of cons you get back is so little, it's ridiculous. But anyways, 
We're gonna get home in a couple hours, run everything through the multi-sluice. We'll take a look at what we got, we'll go from there.